Thursday and we are about to do some uh, workout today. And ang aming workout ay para sa underarm. Tama ba? So, yes. underarm slab workout. So, sabi dito, we have to get rid our arm fit and back fat. Okay? So, pakilala ko yung mga um, ka-body ko today. Okay? Ka-workout ko for today's section. Okay? So, ito si Rachel. So, nag-join siya ng fitness challenge. Okay? So, so far, as of today. Okay? So, nakapagbawas na siya ng 4.2 pounds. Yes! 4.2 pounds. Clap, 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 clap. Rachel. And then, ito si Alia. So, si Alia ay ika-third na batch niya na sa pagsali ng fitness challenge. And then, overall, nakapagbawas na si Alia ng 25 points. Woo! Yun! 25 points. Okay, so guys, are you ready? Ready! Ready! Okay, guys. Position, position. Okay, so, um, ito ay inspired again ng aming workout by Emmy Wong. So, thank you kay Emmy Wong. Pinapadali ang aming life. <laughs> okay, so arm naman ito. Starting the workout with arm circles. Don't worry, it's a little quickie. It's an amazing warm-up to start getting the under arm area to burn. And doing it for 45 seconds non-stop might not be as easy as you think. Okay, 45 seconds each workout. Okay, go. Stand up tall, feet hip width apart. Arms straight out to the side. Rotate them in circles to the front for 22 seconds, and then we'll switch to rotate to the back. As you can see, here, I'm rotating my whole arm to make sure I can really work that savvy part under our arm instead of just moving my hands all four arms. Three, two, one, two. Back, back. The more power you put into the movement, the more fun you get. Maintain your whole arm straight. Don't jump until the time I stop. Actually, first time I'm going to Okay, so say, okay, so say, 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 so the more work you put in, the more results you see. Switch direction to rotate to the back. Three, two, one, 
Back. Each rotation will activate the burn in the underarm area, so really work your arms here, make every circle count. <laughs> and we're on to the fifth exercise, knee push-up. Get down onto the mat, hands under your shoulder, knees also on the floor. So instead of knee push-up, so ang gagawin namin ay side-to-side. Knees! Side! Try to keep the back flat, butt down as you draw shoulder blades back and down. Keeping elbows hooked close to your body. Once your elbows are forming around 90 degree angle, push yourself back up. This is one rep. This is always tough, especially to do it for 45 seconds non-stop. You can see that I'm dying here, and it's getting harder for me to keep my butt down, but try as hard as you can. If you're doing this workout with me because you want to see results, I want to help you see results, but it will only be possible if you're willing to put in the work together with me. So no giving up, no flexing. I'm super proud of you for sticking it out with me even when it gets tough. Stick you can stand back up for a ring the bell. You might have done this with me before, so go for an effect. Okay, you're done. Go! Hold your hands together in a fist. Lift them behind your head, bending your elbow. Then extend your arms straight to hit the spot directly above your head as if there's an imaginary bell there. We're hitting the bell as hard as we can. Then lower your head behind your head again. Sorry that my fist is going out of frame here, but you get the idea. We're giving our all to ring the bell to get the most out of this exercise. You can see on screen that my underarm area is trembling every time I hit the bell. This is the flabby area we are targeting. So keep going from you guys. Your body, work it out so that your head to toe is in one straight line. 
and gave him a call, which is not back up to God in his I challenge you to walk as far back as you can so you can get the most burned out of it. This is not the only thing you can Get it done together with me, no stop it. exercise when you fly chop. This is a new variation, feet wide and shoulder width apart. Bend your upper body down to almost here level to the floor. Foot back with a slight bend in your knees, back flat, then hands together in the fist in front of your chest. Put in the force to chop back as high as you can. Chop hard every single rep. Less than one minute to go guys. Push it, let every movement do the work. Trust the process and you'll get to your goals, I promise you.